here's a quick logo idea for reps event planners let's see if you like this one open a blank canvas and then press t for text and increase the size of the text to a large number and then you're going to type the name so we are working with reps event planning today so we're going to make that nice and big and quick and easy and simple we're going to change the font and we're going to make the font monotone one of my favorite fonts that i have also included on my course if you want to check it out on udemy you can this is one of my beautiful versatile fonts that you could do so much with and bring it to about 230 and then add it to your canvas change the color make it a silver gray this gray that we like so much and i'm gonna make the background black so that you see how gorgeous it looks with the silver color that you've included because we are going with curves today you're gonna click the text to highlight it and then you're gonna select effects and then you're gonna scroll down to curves and you're gonna curve the name of the business not a hundred percent just curve it slightly in this format so that it's a little bit curvy you can always make adjustments go back to your elements and search for this tiny little curve line ornament and add that to your design it's gonna come with a grayish blackish color change it also to a silver color and then drag it so that it is covering the name this is what i mean when i said you could just go back to your curve and adjust it so that it curves nicely with the text and the line curve that you've added on there so i want this curve to be duplicated so you're going to add two of these so that it looks like that and then if you feel like it's too big you can always select everything and reduce the size to a size that you're comfortable with the last thing that you're going to do you press t for text and this time we don't want monotone we're going to change the text and the font to a font that's readable something like a sense an open sense and then you align it on your design and then you go to your spacing and you space the letters and then go to your effects and then curve that as well and adjust it so that it suits the curve that you've added on there you can space it in a way that suits the design the one that makes you happy and this is our first design then you access photop.com and you select templates and then you're gonna pick any of these 3d mockups and you select it using the link and once it's opened up you're going to double click where it says your logo here on the checkout box and then you hide the example and then you go to your downloads and you add it to the design and you make it nice and big by sizing it and then you're going to press command s or control s on windows to change it to smart objects select on the first page and your design looks absolutely stunning love it love it love it you're gonna go file export as a png and you're good to go if you want more ideas you can go to our logo playlist and i will see you with our next video